So I'm going to combine two questions here because I think that they're somewhat similar. Um, we got some questions about, you know, are there certain foods that can cleanse or detoxify the brain? I, I think when I hear the word detox, that's a red flag. I mean, you have your kidney and your liver, right? They do a good job. So just leave it alone at that. And and, and it, can, it can be difficult for people to 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 understand that because that word is used so ubiquitously on social media detox this and detox that and then they have these supplements for detoxification as well which doesn't make any sense your liver and your kidney do a great job at it but if you as far as food is concerned if you eat a diet that consists of fruits and vegetables and whole grains nuts and seeds and lean proteins and sources of omega-3 fatty acids you're really giving your body and your brain everything that it requires to function normally you know what's really important? Calories. Making sure that you get enough calories. The brain functions on sugar and on glucose. Yeah. Um, and so, you know, you have these glucose goddesses of the world who are trying to fear monger carbohydrates and glucose, and it's just ridiculous. Aisha, I'm sure you would co-sign something that Sarah has said probably on almost all of our episodes that what's good for your body is good for your brain.